Okay, this can be a quick tutorial on how to use the line transfer option on the PLT300 with the PLC, uh, sorry, the PLC300 with the PLT300 robotic total station. Uh, line transfer is a really quick way to, uh, it's basically a reference line, you're it is a reference line you're creating for yourself. So for instance, if you go into line transfer, uh, usually you usually have your prism with you and you find a, a control point or a, 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 you, you make sure you're on some sort of grid line on your job site, you create a line. So I'm going to measure my point one. I'm pretending that I'm on a, I'm only in a parking lot, but I'm pretending I'm on a control point. Measure my point one of the line I know I need to be on. Then I'm just moving over a few feet here. Ideally I should be level, but I'm just doing a demo here. I measure my point two. And so now I have a line. And what it did is that first point I measured over there is my zero, zero. This is now my northern, um, my northern point. But it's telling me basically where I am in relation to that line. And this offset is if I go forward, because my point was, again, my, my zero, zero is there, which means my positive north is this way, which means the way I'm facing now, that is my positive east, and behind me is my negative east. So you can see here, I've moved positive east two feet, nine and a quarter inch off my line. If I come back here, now I'm negative my line, negative two feet approximately. Now what's nice is, let's say I have this line, um, and for whatever reason I, um, I need to create an offset on that. There's a lot of times you have a grid line, and you need to find an exact two foot offset from that grid line. Here we go, I'll go ahead and create an offset, two feet. And it's telling me, okay, well, I, in order to get to the two feet mark, I need to move right there. And notice in the top left corner, it's telling me, hey, you are at your two foot offset from your grid line. You know, instead of saying zero, zero, it's conveniently telling you your two feet, just to remind you that you're two feet off the grid line that you first threw in there. Um, so let me set this back down to zero, and obviously it's telling me I need to move back to get to my zero, zero. Okay, so now uh, this is nice and convenient because if I wanted to, I can uh, create a third point. And what creating a third point does is it puts the zero, zero of my line at the 90 degree angle over my third point would be. So remember my point one was over there, my point two was over here. If I make my point three back here, and I say measure, and now it's created a, excuse me, this has now created a, a 90 degree angle directly on that line to where I'm perpendicular here. So my line was over there, no, I have a 90 degree a 90 degree line right here. This is really convenient if, again, you have a grid line in the floor, you, you realize where they intersect and you need to make the, a, a quick 90 degree angle from that grid line, this is how you do it. So now, instead of me, if I go forward, I'm basically staying on that line because I now created a 90 degree angle for myself. If I go right, notice that I'm now, I'm now going to negative easting because remember, my, my new zero, zero is now down there. And my positive north is behind me. So now if I move left of this line, I'm actually moving to my negative easting. If I move right, I'm moving to my positive easting. So if I move right, I'm now on my positive line. I'm, I'm, excuse me, my positive easting. Okay, I can even offset this line. I can offset this line two feet. Okay, so I can really do a lot here. So, or I can just say, put that back to zero put this back to zero. Now I'm back to my original line. I'll move back to my original line. And there I am. Okay, so that's how the offset works. That's how the angle works. Now here's a fun... Um... Now here's where you can just go in here and, and create a brand new reference line if you want to. So it's, it's really convenient. Uh, maybe some of the things that it's missing is uh, the ability to uh, say exactly where along the line you want to be. Like, for instance, if I have this line, I, I just created this line, right? I want to I want to tell the tool to take me exactly, I can tell my offset I want to be, I want to be exactly five feet off that line, but what if I want to be five feet off that line and exactly three feet north of my zero, zero? I can't do that in this application. I have to go to another one. But that's how you quickly get a line and uh, find your offices from there.